What's going on everyone? Today it's the official break and I have a little logic tutorial. If you don't know this already, there's a bunch of tutorials on this, but I want to get the people that haven't or if they're newer, not good at logic, or if they just don't know about it yet, you came to the right place. Play subscribe for more stuff like this if you're really interested in like Oaklands and all that. Uh, so right now we're going to go get the logic materials, but if you don't know where they're at, I'll have a fast little snippet of me driving there from the Oak Depot, because you got to know where the Oak Depot is. Um, we'll go get the logic, but first, let's actually get the spawn pad. So a lot of people don't know where the spawn pad is. Back in the old map, it used to be in the lighthouse, but it's actually in Illumine Design. Um, Illumine Design, whatever it is. So let's actually do a little fast snippet of us getting the spawn pad at least. So, all right, let's go. Here we are, we're at the store, and it's actually gonna be on this right side. These are what they look like. Property spawn location. You wanna grab one of these. And the little thing, if you didn't know about this shop, you don't have to put it on the table. Some people think you have to put stuff on the table. You can literally put it in front of them like that, and he will still recognize with, recognize that as something you can buy. So you can do that, and I'll put that in the truck. Now we are back at the Oak Depot. Let's actually go get the logic. So now to get the logic, we got the spawn spawn pad. Now to go get the logic. All right, now you are at the logic store. So these are the things you're gonna need. You're gonna need these top three. You're gonna need chat commander, the transmitter. The receiver, you're going to need an AND gate right here. A lot of things are a little bit laggy to pick up. I am in a public server right now. And then you're going to need an interactor. So you should need all of these. And then take note of the price at checkout just so you know how much you're going to need for all of this stuff in total. Right here, $5,310. Absolutely. All right, and once you have all that, I'll meet you back at the base. Don't even think about forgetting the number interface or it won't work, okay? How about you just don't forget the number interface? How about you make a tutorial that doesn't leave anything out? 520 for that. Okay. Now that you're at your base, uh, you can get a little screenshot of this if you want to make sure you have everything. Go ahead, go, go. Yeah, now that you screenshotted that, super awesome picture. Send it in my Discord. Um, what you're going to do, you can place down your property spawn, wherever you want to spawn. We'll just do in the corner for now. If you want to get one of your interactors, you want to place that inside of the spawn. And then you can get your receiver open, your transmitter. And then also the commander or whatever. Yep. And then you can set whatever whatever you want to put your base to. Like I'll do uh, exclamation rib. Let's do all caps. Oh no no. We'll do it like that. Set that. So it'll be that. Let's copy that. Okay. Right here. And then, boop. Okay, and then once you have those all set to crib, you can do your, I think it's receiver. Yeah, 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 it's your receiver. You wanna put that beside your uh, interactor facing up because it's a lot better to route wires when the, uh, the wire side is facing up. And then you want to get your 
you can set these right here. You can get your and gate. Just depending on where you want everything. I'll, I'll probably not like to put everything like close to each other. You get your um like this. We'll actually flip this around. This okay. Put this right here. And if you want to, you can kind of put all this stuff in the same area. I'd put it all in here if you can fit it. So it's not all bulky and stuff. And then you want to get your number interface. We'll place it like this for now just so we can edit it and you can see on the side. You want to set that to 10. Oh yeah, and with the receivers, you have to make sure you do the exclamation mark, whatever you want to put. So that's your code word in the chat. All right, so let me flip this around. We'll place that right here. And then this is your transmitter. So whatever you type in, it'll go to the transmitter and then I'll link over here. And then this is how you wanna hook everything up. Create a wire right here. Oh, okay, great wire. Well, my, it just might be a little laggy. It is a public server. <laughs> Okay, mm, and then you go from right here, right here. Oh, let me exit out of that one here, just like that, right here, just like that. And then you want to connect this up into itself, this little receiver into. It might have already connected, it's kind of laggy. Receiver into the uh, inter... So many words, man. Interactor. You got your commander, you got your number of base, right? And if it should, it should work. So this is a little compact, it should work. So if I go over here and I do... Exclamation crib. Boom, it spawns me right back at home. There we go, and it worked. So that's, that's how you spawn back at your base with some logic without actually having to kill your character. It's a lot faster than a lot of other stuff. Like if you reset your character, it takes a lot of time. So if you're like this, crib. Oh wait, I spelled it wrong. <laughs> C-R-I-B, crib, boom. Spawn back at the crib. And you can do this with a lot of stuff. You can do this, any interactor you can put in thing, you can do interactor in a, property spawn you could do it with a car do different um text for the car but this is a quick little tutorial guys subscribe i'd love to have you guys part of the brick gang join the brick gang um like like the video so i get put into the algorithm of youtube because the algorithm could kind of be a little a little harsh sometimes you know hit the bell get notified and i'll see you guys in the next video peace out oh yeah what do, what do we do at the end i think we go Thank you.